Now then, the sun is shining. Did you notice that on your way here today? Yay! 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 Yes, the, uh, the coldest winter in 30 years is officially over, apparently, with some saying today is the first day of spring. However, with the absence of seasonal daffodils, other people are suggesting we're still going to be firmly in the grip of winter for another few weeks. Mm. Oh. So, yeah, so has spring sprung for you today, ladies? Well, do you know, I, I leave the house in the morning in the dark... And I was, so I have a kip in the car on the way in. And I had a little kip this morning and I woke up on the M4, not on it, it's yeah. still, <laughs> still in the car. And I looked out the window and it was beautiful sunshine yeah. streaming into the car. And it did, it really lifted my spirits. I thought, oh, I'll go and see the girls today. Yeah. Might have a little sit outside a cafe later on or something. It's magical though, isn't it? <laughs> I can find some friends. Don't you think it's magical though, spring? It's yeah. just, you know, it's clean. You feel as though you've cleansed yourself and here we go and the trees are all going, Oh, look at this. Yeah. Oh, oh, bud, 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 bud. That's what they do, you see. <laughs> do you have a spring in your step? A spring I do, you because, stay? you know, there's a little patch outside my house which is a long green bit and every year the daffs come up and then they go, don't they? Because they don't have long to live, do the dust? And then, and now they've just poking their heads up, and you go, oh, yes, but they're only here. just. They're only just poking their heads up. Well, I know they're late, aren't they? They're very late. I think, late. Oh, yeah. I still think it's all very gloomy. And what's worrying me is it says make the most of today in this bit of sunshine, girls, because <gasps> by the middle of the week it's gone again. It's going to be cold, oh, dark, oh, rain. Excuse me, excuse oh, me. Oh, fed up excuse with Excuse me, as a farmer's daughter, it's oh? March winds do blow, and we shall have. No, and then what will the robin do then, poor thing? I just think I'd point oh. that out to you. I don't know what that <laughs> means. I don't know what that means. Because like it's not ready yet. Us no. people uh. know about the land. It's not time yet, is it? It's but when it's the lambs are coming. The, lamb, the lambs are coming, aren't lambs they? Lambs coming. Oh, I had roast lamb though. yesterday. It was lovely. <laughs> So did we, actually. But it's not... Don't get above no. yourselves. No, okay. it's not there yet. But oh, the birds no. are starting. You're the quite birds. Right. It's the birds when you hear them, don't you, now? Well, there's an, owl, there's an owl outside my house, so I think must be looking for a mate, because he's hooting away. Oh, is that away. not Eamon? No, that's... No, yes, not... that's... <laughs> <laughs> I'll check. <laughs> <Thanks. laughs> Talking of Eamon, it has been a massive weekend for football, hasn't it? Especially in our house. Manchester United winning the Carling Cup final yesterday. Thank the Lord for that. Um, it was also the first time that former teammates John Terry and Wayne Bridge, of course, met on um, the pinch, uh, pitch since the uh, scandal. Oh, Ooh, yes. <laughs> that scandal surrounding their private lives. And as Man City and Chelsea players shook hands before kickoff, uh, Bridge did manoeuvre his hand straight to that young mascot standing next to Terry, leaving him uh, empty handed. So you could say it was a rather public snub, wasn't it? So 